Now to the story of an unexpected but powerful friendship found in a grocery store. Uh, Steve Hartman shows how the innocent encounter in a canned food aisle touched an 82-year-old widower when he needed it the most. Not long ago, in a cemetery outside Augusta, Georgia, a loving couple was buried. The wife buried below this white bouquet. The husband buried above in a mound of grief. Took me totally by surprise. 82-year-old Dan Peterson says after Mary died, he fell into a deep depression. Spent days just staring out at the squirrels. For six months, it was just that bad. And then one day you go to a grocery store. <laughs> it all changed inside this Publix. But that's when this unapproachable man was approached by a four-year-old girl named Nora Wood. In the security footage, you can see Nora randomly reaching out to him. Her mom, Tara, says it was quite embarrassing. She stood up and said, Hi, old person, it's my birthday today. Old person? Old person. Hi, old person. She says this to this cranky old man? Yeah. And then had the audacity to demand a hug. I said, a hug? I said, absolutely. <laughs> <laughs> Nora got her hug and then asked her mom to take a picture of her with her new friend. She zeroed in on him like a missile. And she didn't want anything from him. She just wanted to make him feel loved and give him a hug. And his little lip quivered and he was teared up and it was just sweet. And I said, you don't know. This is the first time for quite a while that I've been as happy. That all happened a couple months ago, and his grin has only gotten wider since. Hi, sweetheart. Come in. Come in. Today, Nora visits at least once a week. So how's my sweetie, huh? And every time, it's the grocery store all over again. I knew I was going to get a hook. <laughs> oh, it's unbelievable. Totally unbelievable. It's a bridge. It's a bridge. Oh, okay. She fell asleep holding a picture of them. I... What? <laughs> To Dan, it's equally miraculous, but far less mysterious. He believes Nora is, quite literally, an angel. She opened me to a love that I didn't know existed. You know, they say if you're open to new connections and new things, you'll never know what you find, and there is one of them. Uh, he, Dan Peterson does have his own grandkids, but they've all grown up. We'll leave it to Steve Hartman too, right. to show us that. Now Dan also says that there are a lot of old people out there who could really use a hug from a preschooler, but who could probably just use a hug from just right. about anybody. Exactly.